Hello, and welcome to the special international episode of Blind Soulmates. <laughs> I'm your host from Blind Soulmates in Ireland, Christopher McLaughlin. And I'm Annabelle Magdalene, your host from Blind Soulmates in America. We have a wonderful show for you this evening, in which we'll be bringing together couples from different countries just to see how compatible they are. By now you've probably seen the show several times before, but if you're one of the few who've never turned on a telly, then I'll tell you how it works. We have thousands of applicants, all from different mm -hmm. parts of the world. We painstakingly research all of our files till we find two people from two separate countries who we believe will match up. Once we've picked out a couple, we send them on a date that we feel matches their personalities and will allow them to become better acquainted and hopefully fall in love. <laughs> or at least get into each other's pants. <clears throat> um, our first couple will make you hotter than a priest in Sunday school. She is a working woman from Russia and he is working it in France. Let's meet our couple. Bonjour, my name is Pierre Jean Nevers, and I am here to make love to all your women. I raise pigs. This is such wonderful wine. The grapes were grown in my hometown in France. This wine was born 20 years before my parents even met. I have six pigs. Mm. These grapes were handpicked and crushed by uh, French monks who all died in a freak kind of vigil accident. We are going to slaughter three of them tomorrow. We. Oui. She's the most animalistic girl I have ever met. There's a raw savage within her that I have never seen. I must have her. You must tell me about yourself. I have to know. When I was a little girl in Russia, we did not have a lot of money. My father was a horseshoe salesman. And then we discovered there were no horses in all of Russia. My mother was a potato farmer, but we thought it was too cold to grow potatoes in Russia. Five years later, we realized we were wrong again. To make money, they tried to sell me as a male or the bride in America, but my deformed 11th toe would not pass during vigorous male or the bride inspection. And that is when I discovered pigs. Where are my pork chops? Your eyes light up like the Eiffel Tower is behind them. <laughs> Is that a sick cow? But it doesn't matter. I love you. Uh, oh! I have been wrong for so many years. So many women. So much lust. I cannot have you as one of my conquests. You have enlightened me beyond my years. Uh, they say that if you love something, then you must set it free. And if it returns to you, then it is yours to keep. This is what I must do. No, don't speak. I must go. Leave this moment as beautiful as it will, glistening off of your chin. I can't believe that just f happened. You can't say that. Oh, I thought it was... Romantic. Our next couple is a match made in heaven. She's a lovely young woman of England, and he's a strapping young man of Scotland. Let's meet our couple. Hello. 